everybody. We're out today with Todd, drove up from Phoenix, Arizona, to come wheeling with us in southern Utah. So we'll be wheeling around Gunlock, Utah today, then west into Nevada, and south all the way to Mesquite. Alright, we got our first stop over here at Gunlock Reservoir. Old Spanish Trail. Ooh. Stories in stone. Walking around here looking for petroglyphs. It's supposed to be all over the ground. Check it out. A couple big footprints. See the five toes? one there and then I think this is a hand. Is that a hand? Yeah, it's a foot. back out on our first trail of the day. Ah. I just dropped the GoPro. Man down.
find them right there, fire pit on your left. There are, it's a designated, marked, numbered campsite. They're just random throughout this whole region. Driving through this massive Joshua tree forest now. Working our way. We're only about 30 miles from the town of Mesquite, Nevada. But we think we found some petroglyphs. At least there was a sign saying there was probably petroglyphs. Uh-oh, they're yelling at me. They're over here. See, got Ta, got me, I got really muddy. Oh, we got petroglyphs. There's a couple hidden back here behind this bush. Oh yeah. Little circle there. Probably was a guy, person, with arms maybe. Well, we got some up here on this cliff. No, it's actual paint. I haven't seen any paint done on any rocks around here. So this is a symbol. stone cabins way out here in the middle of the Nevada desert. Look like they've been here for a few minutes. Well, we're back. Day two. Got Todd behind us again. We're in the Nevada desert. We're heading out to Gold Butte National Monument, Grand Parachon. All over. We 
he stumbled on some that are on that will, you're gonna mark you'll have to mark uh, on the byway they're right on a cliff right in the wash I think those are the ones I might have been looking for and I couldn't find yeah that's the ones that I found the arrowhead in. yeah they're pretty cool we always stop at those it's on the way to seven keyholes all right let's take a walk over here to Falling man. It's about a quarter mile hike through some rocks like this. What you basically have to do is go through the area and walk in around the rocks, look up on the sides of the walls, and you'll find stuff all over. Look for things like footprints. Looks like a big foot footprint on the side of a wall. There's a uh, Bighorn sheep, deer, infinity circles. Up top there, on top of that cliff, there's two rock faces. There is petroglyphs. Certainly a lot more around here that are easier to get to. Oh, look at that little arch over there. A hole to the rock. It's just so peaceful out here. So quiet, nothing. No jet noise. Traffic. This is the wind carving through here. This isn't a creek bed, this isn't a river bed, there's nothing flowing through here. This is just wind, and when you duck through there, you feel the wind blowing, just shooting right through there, and there's barely a breeze out here today.
pushed over in that hole there, bro. Yeah, I, I thought it was off the road a lot, but there was just that little rock shot right there. He had things in between me, I think he just wasn't paying attention. Yeah, I'm sure the passenger in his truck wasn't too happy. Yeah, he might need an alignment, he didn't have a great partner. Start uh, to map Devil's Throat. It's a sinkhole out here in the uh, Arizona Strip, Gold Butte area. Short little trail. It's off of uh, Gold Butte Scenic Byway. Get this one mapped. I'll show you some pictures of it. Devil's Throat, sinkhole, nice plaque, Devil, Devil's Fire Petroglyphs. A little rocky point out here. You guys are taking off. Huh? Petroglyphs up there on the rock. stop and out the back trail. Check it out. If you like what you see and you want to see more, receive notifications, new videos, or even join us on the trail sometime. Click that subscribe button. trail so let's come down through here let's keep the cattle out it's a shortcut way up top yeah let's go sneak by this palm come up here oh. 
I'm just walking along up here, in Little Finland. Let's see some petroglyphs. Oh yeah, oh, yeah those definitely are. There's more on the other side. That was Little Finland. The place is awesome. Petroglyphs, we ended up finding right at the last minute. Um, tip for that spot, definitely have to go climbing up, get up on top to see those rocks. Uh, go all the way to the end of the trail and climb up top. Once you get up there, there's big black areas on the top of the rocks that are all, looks like a coral reef. Big black areas look close. They got chipped in little petroglyphs, different symbols, different animals. Very neat. So you got a couple things to look for when you get up there. Now we got a long drive out, Gold Butte. Work our way back out to Mesquite, Nevada. formation out here. Found it off of Gold Butte Byway. These little arches. I didn't find any petroglyphs around here, but this is just north of the Little Finland area. Same red rocks, just a little bit north. Ambitious. like what you see here, maybe want to join us on the trail one day or share some of your experiences on the trails that we ran or share some new trails with us. Check out exploremore.net. Go onto the forum. Post up. End of another run. Two days, uh, about 170, 180 miles. Well, thanks again for watching.